Juveniles that cannot sit on the international table and talk about Kenya. Juveniles who have been given power and authority by themselves, not by the people of this country. And all they keep on saying is singing Raila, Raila, Raila. I don't want to say an F word because the media is here. Because you know that I can also use my tongue and use it whippingly, the same way my mom taught me. Kashagwa, let me refer you to Honorable Sabula, the Deputy Governor of Kakamega, and a member of DAP. If you can't listen to what Sabula told you yesterday, then you have no ears. You are just one man, small man, who has now organized Mungiki to cause mayhem tomorrow. And I'm asking those Kenyans with smartphones, wangapi wako na ile picha kupiga, atuata kama mliko mizi, onyesha juu. Kesho muko na kazi ngapi mbili. Ya kwanza ni kumulika yule askari ambao mebeba grunet, piga ye picha. Wangapi wata piga ye picha kesho? Ya tatu, tunambiwa kwamba taleto watu wakiwa na uniform kuingilia vijana yetu. Iyo, tuta, iyo baba ataongea, because sina authority ya kuongea po. Lakini hile ambaye ngetaa kusema ni hivi. To those who have been told, to those 500 motorcycles that have been uh, already... <laughs> brought in by a person and members of one tribe, ethnicity, because they don't want to speak in other languages that you can't understand them. Their work tomorrow is, kwena mahali tumefanya maandamano, wanaingia pale, wanaua watu, wana cause mayhem, and Mr. Chungwa, listen to me, you are not a man enough. If you are a man enough, come and talk to me. <laughs> Mr. Ndindi Nyoro, let me put you on notice that I don't fear you. Naika kibaraka kingine kanaitwa Malala. Abusing Baba all the time. Baba, do I have permission to continue? Every time huyu Raila ta, wacha vitisho ya mavi ya kuku. Some of us have been in jail for a very long time. Some of us have been in exile for so many years. Some of us have fought for democracy in other countries. And we can't fight for democracy for our own country. Baba, you brought us up and you brought us up to be courageous, fearless, and we have to follow what we have to. Kuna askari moja ni meuliza Mr. Kome. I've been a policeman myself, so what? I've asked Kome to issue a statement within 12 hours. He never issued. And that policeman by the name of John Mwiti from Olkalao, police station, that John Mwiti who wanted to assassinate Baba, Semeni John Mwiti akufe. Semeni hivyo. Yule ambaye alitupa grenade kwa baba. He's a policeman who is serving. He was in the administration of police. He's now in uniform and no action has been taken against that man. Can I continue? And those ones who are wale ambao wanatutisha, wengine walikuwa wanavaa Diapers, wengine kwa na uzu, wanauma na mende uko chini. They never knew what Baba went through. When Baba was sleeping in cold cells, when he was being tortured, when his family was vandalized and vanished, tungine tulukot na nyonya matiti ya nyanya yao. Alafu sa hizu ndi wanakuja wanasema, we shall shape the democracy of this country. How do you expect those kind of bastards to shape our democracy? Where will your children go? Watoto wenu wataenda wapi? Kukiwa na hawa, tukama hawa, and they are the leaders of this country. Are you with me or not? Members of the press, I run a news media in Rochester, New York. And I've run it for a very long time. I know what you journalists go through. You are paid peanuts because there are some stupid politicians who will always give you a hundred or a thousand. Funga virago enda. You must be paid properly under Baba's government. We must have a proper regulation proper legal regulation to regulate the press so that those